Welcome everyone today. Um, we're here today in downtown Albemarle uh, at the Stanley County History Center to celebrate um, the unveiling of this uh, presentation by the Stanley County Arts Council as they celebrate their 50 year anniversary. So we're very happy uh, to be here today. I, I'm Will Honeycutt. I'm here with the Stanley County Chamber of Commerce and um, just want to thank the Arts Council for being members for all that uh, that all the volunteers and supporters do to support the arts in our community. It's a very important part of our community and, and the Chamber of Commerce uh, is very appreciative of that. So thank you very much. Um, I'm gonna introduce um, David Cartrett, who is the board chair for the Stanley County Arts Council for a, a few words. Thank you, Will. Sure. Good afternoon, everybody, and thank you for joining us today. On April the 1st of 1974, the Stanley County Arts Council was established and that means that this year is our 50th anniversary. When we started planning for this historic year, the board of directors and the executive director decided early on that having an exhibit at the Stanley County History Center was one of our top priorities. We are excited to officially open the exhibit today. The focus of the exhibit is primarily and correctly on the arts organizations that call Stanley County home and secondly, to highlight the role of the Arts Council as a means to cultivate creativity. Arts organizations such as the URA Players, the Stanley County Concert Band, the Stanley County Chorale, and the Stanley Arts Guild, and many others have provided artifacts for the displays that demonstrate their own unique histories. That these organizations exist is a clear indication that the arts in Stanley County is a team effort and largely a volunteer one. For a county of our size and population, we are quite fortunate to have such diverse arts organizations, an arts guild for visual artists, a concert association that brings professional bands and other performers to our county, a concert band for those who were not ready to give up playing their instruments after high school, <laughs> a chorale for those who are blessed with pitch-perfect voices that sound like angels, two theater groups, depending upon the age, that entertain us with comedies, musicals, and dramas, and a ballet organization that takes upon itself the daunting task of producing a top-notch nutcracker. As you will see as you take a look at the exhibit, all of the outside cases visually describe each of these organizations' mis missions and histories. In the center, you can learn more about the role of the Arts Council itself. In many ways, we are a quiet supporter of the aforementioned organizations and several other entities. I can't get to All right, this. let me get out of the way here. Thank you, um, David. Thank you to the Arts Council for all that you do again. and. Um, we're gonna cut the ribbon. So we've got a big group, we'll count down. <laughs> we'll, three, two, one. We'll count down from five. So we'll start at five, four, four three, three, two, two one. one. 